Hello, and welcome to the Eros Good News Report for July 2024. One of the top neuroscientists in the country, Dr. Andrew Newberg, is releasing a new book called Sex, God, and the Brain, largely based on his groundbreaking study on orgasmic meditation. It will be released on August 6th, mark your calendars. Additionally, he just published the latest study on his results on OM. Comparing 40 OM practitioners to non-meditators, it was found that orgasmic meditation has long-term effects on the brain. Specifically, it affects regions of the brain associated with social areas, emotional processing, focusing attention, sexual function, and similar effects to other studies for meditators and advanced meditators. Joining our library of 13 published books already, Yi Ving's memoir, Finding Myself in Mom's Kitchen, a memoir of a Hmong woman, is set to be published in early October of this year. Nicole Daydon's memoir, Women, Fire, and Dangerous Things, is in its final edit and will be published also at the end of this year. On the Eros platform, we have launched a series of new podcasts. The first is with Alicia Price, interviewing guests about their journey in orgasmic meditation. Clips are already up there and on YouTube. Go check them out. Rachel Pelletier also started a new podcast titled Journey into the Mystic, a series where she and guests uncover the powerful intersections between the mystical and Eros. Watch her first episode with Dr. Andrew Newberg. Our YouTube channel overall has hit a milestone of 400,000 subscribers. A huge thank you to all of our followers for your support. If you are going to be in the Petaluma area, go visit Organic Erotic's new storefront. This month, they hosted their first events with music and displays of their beautiful products. In the press, we've had a variety of articles in the Daily Mail, New York Post, and Law 360, covering several issues of misconduct in the case against Nicole and Rachel. This media attention is crucial for our advocacy efforts. Inspired by a series of writing by Nicole Dedon called the Prophetic Sutras, there are 10 new art videos that you can find on her Instagram, which has been growing rapidly and reaching 15,000 followers soon. Thank you to all of our supporters. Bob Wilms from our Earth program met with Gideon Bromberg, the leading ecologist working on the Dead Sea and Jordan River in Israel, to discuss a potential collaboration to help heal the Salt Sea. Gideon Bromberg has already created a partnership between Jordanian, Israeli, and Palestinian governments that has seen over 11 kilometers of Jordan River restored. In other news from our nonprofit, Free Food gave away burritos and introduced the Art of Addiction program during a street outreach at the Marcus Garvey Park. The event was hosted by Juan Cortez and Walter Bosque from On Point, Lincoln Detox, and the Young Lords, a fantastic effort to support our community. Unconditional Freedom started a new eight-week course on the art of soul-making and the free food culinary program at Exodus's Alternative to Incarceration Facility. We've been teaching at Exodus for over a year, and this is the first cohort of students funded by a grant. We're excited about the impact these programs will have. We're thrilled to announce that Baldor Specialty Foods has become our new meat donor for free food, providing high-quality specialty meats valued at $5,000. We are in over 500 facilities for our prison monastery program nationwide, including those who are on death row. One of our beautiful participants decided to create a beautiful black Tara statue for our new Harlem Center using recycled materials found in prison, a remarkable piece of art born from resilience. Kate Fagan, the prison monastery director, was booked for her third podcast interview about the prison monastery. Her second interview, Penned, was released this week, gaining lots of attention. Last but not least, Women Over Dinner has had 1,153 women attend our dinners globally to date, with 56 dinners held in 32 cities. There are 23 more dinners scheduled worldwide in the coming months. Our recent Harlem Women Over Dinner was a beautiful evening with 40 women, including Topeka K. Sam. Thank you for listening to this month's Eros Good News Report. We will see you soon.